What's going on Collider Games fans? I'm Caboose and today what I got for you guys is an update on the Halo TV series. For those who don't know, this has been something that has been trying to get off the ground for a long while now. And while it seems we are finally there, the show is officially moving forward and has gotten a 9 episode order over on Showtime. Now, it was last reported earlier in December of 2018 that Rupert Wyatt, who is the director of Rise of the Planet of the Apes, unfortunately departed as the series showrunner. Well, now they have hired Otto Bathurst, and he is on board to direct the pilot episode, and he will direct a bunch of other episodes after that for the series. Now, for those unfamiliar with the name Otto Bathurst, he is the director of the recently released Robin Hood film, which wasn't received too well, so I'm sure some people out there might be a little cautiously optimistic when hearing this news. However, on the TV side of things, Otto has done some great things. He directed the National Anthem episode of Black Mirror, and he also kickstarted the first three episodes of Criminal Justice and Peaky Blinders. So he's done some pretty great things over on the TV side of things, so it's definitely a good choice to have him as the show runner and it seems it will be good for him to direct a few episodes overall i'm very happy to hear this the production is set to begin later this year for the halo tv series and like i said earlier in the video they have a nine episode order over on showtime so i am happy to hear that the halo tv series is happening hopefully this is it you know hopefully there are no more delays there are no more problems hopefully this means we are going to get this show sooner than later now, I'm sure the question is going to become for most people, well, what is this show going to be about? What story are they going to tell from the Halo lore? Because that is something very important to what we can expect from this show if we get an idea of that. Now, unfortunately, there's no information regarding specifically what the details of the story or the writing is going to be like for this show. However, if I'm to provide my own opinion, give us Master Chief. No matter what story you tell, Please give us Master Chief, make him the main character of the show, he is the face of the Halo franchise, the character most familiar when you hear about the game Halo, so stop shying away from it, don't tell me no story about a random ODST, don't tell me no story about an Agent Lock, just give us Master Chief. You can introduce those other characters down the line, but as of right now, the best way to kick off this show is to do so with what people who are fans of the franchise are most familiar with above all else, and that is Master Chief. Also, I'm just putting it out there, Terry Crews for Sergeant Johnson, okay? Moving forward, another thing that would help this show have the legs that it could potentially have and go for multiple seasons let the first season be as simplistic as possible. Go to the roots of what Halo initially was when it first came out. You know, it was just some aliens fighting off against the Marines. There's this badass dude named the Master Chief who gets woken out of a cryo sleep and he just goes out and kicks ass. All right, I want the action. I want the simplicity of what Halo 1 was. And then if we get a good season with a decent amount of character development and some great action, we can go to a season two or a season three where we reach out farther into the corners of the Halo lore and pick out some certain awesome stories that may help serve what could be a great season two or a season three. I'm a big fan of Halo. I love the games. I love the story that's being told through these games. And while maybe Halo 4 and Halo 5 haven't been exactly what fans have expected or wanted the Halo franchise to go in the direction of, I still am a fan of this series. And I still am looking forward to Halo Infinite, you know, and I can't wait to see what this live action interpretation is going to be. Honestly, out of all the games out there, I feel Halo deserves some sort of live action interpretation to be told from this franchise the most. It is such a cool story to tell. I just feel that the problem that has been with the film that got canned and the TV show that, that's taking this long to get off the ground is that maybe the projects have been a little too ambitious. So that's why I'm saying, yes, let's tell those complex stories. But first... Let's just start with the simplicity. Let's just start with what people have the most fun with when they play Halo. And that's the action. And that's Master Chief. And you know, because I do call myself Caboose, a red versus blue reference would be pretty awesome. And with that said, now we're going to kick it to you guys. Let us know your thoughts on this in the comments section below. Are you excited that the Halo TV series is finally getting off the ground with Otto Bathurst at the helm? We want to hear your thoughts 
in the comments section below. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, a positive rating would be appreciated. And you can subscribe to the Collider Games channel for more gaming coverage. I've been Caboose, and I'll see you guys later.